What's up, love? Welcome back to another video. I'm Vazi. For those of you who are new here, welcome and thanks so much for being here. If you're a returning subscriber, then you already know what's up, girl. Gratitude. Thank you so much for being consistent with me, okay? Because let's just talk about the consistency lately. It's been... But anyways, today's video, I'm going to be giving you guys what I eat in a day. This is something that I haven't done before, but, you know, I'm just going to try to have fun with it, all right? So, let's go ahead and get into it. But before we do that, if you like these types of videos, if you get any value from my videos, please make sure you are subscribed. Join the family. Let's build this community here. Like-minded, healthy women. Let's grow, learn, and love together, girl, okay? So, hit that subscribe button. Make sure you like this video and share with a friend if you feel the desire to do so. Let's get to it. <laughs> So I almost forgot that I need to take my ginger shot and um, this is something that I'm trying to get in a good habit of doing. I'm currently unable to make my own ginger shots but I did find these at Walmart, my local Walmart and they are pretty damn good. And this one has, it's an immunity boost with cayenne, ginger and turmeric. So I'm going to take this, drink my second bottle of water, and then um, we'll get into breakfast.
right, y'all, now it's time for our post-workout meal, and it's going to be some fire-ass protein pancake. Okay, I got this organic plant protein powder from Walmart as well, and I just use the complete pancake and waffle mix and add in three scoops of the plant protein per the nutrition packs in the back. That's how I'm going to make some serving. And then I'm going to mix it all together, add in the water, and I'm also going to add in some agave at the end just for a little more sweetness. And then we're going to fry these bad boys up and we're going to enjoy them, okay? Of course, I gotta add in some fruit, and today I'm having mangoes. Usually, I do strawberries and blueberries, but I can have any of those, so this is what we're working with. It is gonna just some more agave on top, and we're going to enjoy it. Now, for a snack, I ended up having some popcorn while I was watching Vampire Academy. So good, period. That's it. <laughs> and then for dinner, we had some honey garlic chicken with some rice and broccoli, and I'm gonna show you how to make this honey garlic chicken real quick. So first, you're just gonna season per usual, however you decide to do so, and you're gonna start frying it. I use the, um, I fry on the skin side down first. Girl, I can't even talk. And then I flip it over and I fry it on the other side for about maybe two to three minutes on each side just so that you can get a nice little brown on your chicken. And then once you do that, you're going to transfer it to the pan that you are going to be baking the chicken in because this is going to go in the oven. And then you're going to use the same dish that you fried the chicken in to create your sauce, okay? So for this sauce, you're going to have some brown sugar. You're going to add in some honey, and honey, I eyeballed all of this. I don't have the exact measurements, so, you know, figure it out. <laughs> then I added in some soy sauce. I'm going to add in some black garlic. You can use regular garlic if you choose to. And then I'm also going to add in some vegetable broth. Then you're going to, like, simmer this down and make it all bubbly. You know, taste it and see if you like the sweetness. If it needs a little bit more of something, add that in. And then you're going to drizzle it on top of your chicken, and you're going to pop that in the oven at 350 for about an hour and then you get this delicious plate honey it is so good definitely try it out if you haven't already and yeah that's pretty much it for this video you guys thanks so much for tuning in remember to love yourself wholeheartedly radiate with positivity and vibrate at your highest frequency and until next time peace